And this just into Cron 4, live pictures now of a car that ran into a Starbucks in Milpitas. And to get your mornings faster on this story, we want to hand it over to our solar reporter on the scene. That's Cron 4's Mike Pelton. Mike, the car is gone, but boy, we can see the damage. Well, and there's a lot of cleanup, James. There's glass, debris all throughout the stores. You can see uh, some crew members here cleaning up the debris, even bags of uh, coffee grounds that are left all over the floor of the Starbucks. And if you've ever been to a coffee shop, you know exactly how busy these places get. That's why the manager says they're fortunate that no one inside this building was injured. Authorities say when the car slammed into this building around 7.30, there were five customers and five employees inside at the time. Again, none of them were hurt here at the corner of Calaver. Paris Boulevard in the 680. Uh, the, uh, the restaurant managers tell me that it was a Honda Civic that came into the building. At this point, we have calls into the Milpitas Police Department to try and get some more information as to uh, who the driver is, exactly what happened, how they're doing, and what charges they might face, if any. Uh, we'll, get, we'll bring those updates to you later on in this newscast. Uh, James, as difficult as it might be to believe, the manager tells me that they are going to try and reopen the Starbucks later on this morning as soon as they get the debris and glass swept out of the building there and then, of course, that window replaced. But he says hopefully they will reopen later today. Well, that would be amazing if they could actually do that. And it, like you said, it's really amazing nobody was hurt because, as I understand it, that car went completely into the Starbucks. Right? Is that your understanding as well? Yeah, James, and you can see exactly the trail of debris that goes about halfway into the store here. Just look at where that glass is. That's about halfway into where the store is. And the manager says, you know, uh, in the mornings here, this place gets extremely busy. Anytime you're in a coffee shop, you see people almost shoulder to shoulder. So this is one of the big parts of the Starbucks that people uh, like to gather in. Fortunately, no one was there when that car came in. And James, as you can see, though, that car did uh, make its way into Starbucks quite a bit. Wow, amazing. All right, Mike, thank you very much. Again, reporting live out of Milpitas this morning.